All right, welcome back, Baywolf Nation. It's on Baywolf back at it with another YouTube video. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Existing subscribers, hit the bell notification. You get notified as soon as the video is uploaded. Check out the Amazon store, amazon.com slash shop slash I am Beowulf. And the I am Beowulf merchant, BeowulfNation.com. Whew, we got a gremlin video. Uh, if you haven't seen my past video, I kind of showed this off, revealing, seeing how cool it is. Showed us a bunch of angles. But this gremlin, the streaker, is made by Trick or Treat Studios. This thing is super cool. Now, if you've seen my past video, he can't stand on his own. He's actually propped against the wall, giving the effect he's standing. Now, displaying him, he can his arms can be moved up to have it where he has his trench coat moved open. And I found this company called Nightmare Trash. They make like some really cool. This is all made out of wood uh, and then metal right up here. And it has the Gremlins logo, which it's probably looks like it's just a sticker added on. Uh, and it, it took a little bit to get this, but this just actually came in the mail yesterday. So that's why I was waiting to do a video uh, showing my Gremlin off. It's cool the sunglasses come on so you can tell he is a legit life-size Gremlin. And there's a stand. Now I got a gizmo one made by the same company, another stand with that, which is coming soon. I thought it was all going to be in one box, but they shipped it separately. And I just got this. So I think this is cool with displaying it. He has, I showed him in the past video, he has like a little hook on his back that this is what the stand can do displaying it. Now I'm not sure. They didn't really show photos of like if it should go up like this or like that. Um, but I put it all together and I think this is really cool like a displaced piece I got this really nice shelf in my family room and that's where I'm gonna put them. Uh, hopefully my dogs don't uh, Jump up and, and try getting them because it looks like it's a creature and I, I think anybody that comes to my house They'll walk in and be like, oh <laughs> You got a gremlin in the house So let's get this this uh, put up and I'll show you guys what it looks like Wow now take a look at how much that changes if you've seen what it looked like being against the wall. So I think this is how the hook works. It gets him the closest back as possible. I don't know why I thought the hook goes forward because otherwise it was pushing too forward. And then you can then have his feet where he, that gives the effect that he's actually standing, which is like really cool. Don't forget your shades, man. The sunlight is not on your side. But check out that. And it's actually like, it's pretty neat. Like first they designed this with a hook, which these two companies are not related. And it's somebody figured this out, how to um, display it. But it gives that like really movie quality. Like you walk in, it has gremlins. It looks like you bought a prop from the movie. And it makes it really official too, saying gremlins. Not because it's like people don't know what it is. It just kind of gives that like, you just bought like a prop used in the movie. I think this is like, I'm so glad I bought this. This is like really cool. They're not cheap. Um, but you can find him and his fellow followers on my Amazon store, amazon.com slash shop slash I'm Beowulf. I'm not sure if these are on there, but if they are, I'm going to include them. But the stand is from Nightmare Trash, Trick or Treat Studios. Just look at this. It is so, so cool. And got his sunglasses. Talk about uh, a cool display piece, especially too. Uh, you wake up in the middle of the night, you walk out there, and you forget that there's a gremlin in the house. I just think it's gonna be funny as you get somebody to come over and they're like, whoa, what what is this thing? And especially too if somebody's not seen the gremlins. But like who hasn't seen a gremlins movie? There's two of them. They should be a third one. This is definitely uh really cool. I'm like, I just can't believe the effect it gives it like it's standing. Because when you had it posed, that was my one concern buying it, is I thought it would just stand on its own. And I was like, oh, how am I gonna display it? And I was like, I'll buy it. I didn't even know about the stand when I bought it. And uh, look at the effects too. It's like, you can totally tell like the scales, how the colors change. I don't know if people can tell that, but it is like really cool. But I didn't know how I was going to display this. And I was like, I'll figure it out after the fact of my purchase. And man, I'm so glad I bought this. 
This is really cool. Talk about a childhood memory of the gremlins and then you actually have one. It's so like crazy is there's like a lot of stuff from the 80s and 90s that you wish you had back then. And then fast forward, you know, a big time later that it's actually a reality that it's something you can own that like they didn't have back when that came out. Because you imagine how hot these would have been like right when the movie came out if something like this existed. It's just really neat that that, that something so old has it where the tech, you know, where like something can be done uh, that it just brings a piece. I don't know. Now that you've seen this, I kind of want to get a couple more gremlins because I just think it's kind of cool. I just don't know where I, you know, you got so much space in your house displaying this. You got to pick and choose the really cool stuff. Uh, but definitely, uh, I got the Terminator 2 arcade game. And then I was originally thinking I was going to put him on top of it. But I don't know what I'm going to plan on displaying there. Uh, and then I got the Gizmo one too. So it's like, I have this really long table. Uh, it's on the back of my like family room. So I have a lot of room. He's just got to pick the right things and especially to my dogs are kind of curious i don't want i don't want the streaker gremlin to become a snack so i don't know where i'm gonna put it. i definitely don't want to put this in my bedroom i can tell you that i don't want to wake up being half asleep and look and then see this guy this would be talk about uh i don't want to have nightmares but it, it, and he doesn't scare me at all but i definitely tell you when you're sleeping and you hear a noise and you're like is he alive <laughs> look at the mouth too it's so Man, you imagine if this thing was real and this was in, like in your house? That would be, it's pretty big. Like you imagine like trying to grab this thing against the sharp nails, the sharp teeth, and then they move pretty quick. And the big ears. <laughs> it's really cool. Oh man. I just, I, I think this thing's really neat. Well, if you're new to the channel, man, hit the subscribe button. Existing subscribers, hit the bell notification, you get notified. As soon as the video is uploaded, check out the Amazon store, amazon.com slash shop slash I am Beowulf. And at I am Beowulf merch at BeowulfNation.com. Stay mighty and keep strong.